<laughs> Must free TV exclusive. Tell a rock star. Rock star 2800. Smut free TV. Toxic media. The hottest content is internet streets. You know the truth. Like, comment, subscribe right now. Turn on your notifications. Hit that bell. Hop in them comments because every comment counts. Smut free TV exclusive. All right, y'all, man. Welcome back to another episode of Rockstar Rants. You understand? I'm revamping it. Like, comment, subscribe right now to this channel. Like, comment, subscribe, become a member. Also, follow Smurf Free TV on Instagram. Hop in the comments. Why? Because every comment counts. Don't forget, turn on your notifications. Hit that bell. Become a Smurf Free TV member right now. You understand? So let's get into it, man. Rockstar Rants. You know, spend a lot of time. You know, this Brick Baby, Lil Woody situation. Now, uh, I can remember back, hmm, was it last year? I think it was like late last year. Boxing event was going down. Celebrity influencer boxing match, right? DW Flame, Charleston White. I mean, Sean Cotton. I mean, everybody. I mean, it's all documented. It's on my YouTube. I got all the fights, right? Um. Charleston White went viral, spraying, swaying the plug guy in his face, right? With mace. I got to capture that moment. Now, mind you, this is the first day. This is the weigh-in. The second day is the fight. So, mind you, I'm, I got paid. First of all, I got paid to do this. Shout out 11-11. I got paid to do this. 11-11 hooked that up. You know, send me the information. What I need to do the contract, they cash out, whatever. After that situation, maybe like a week. Okay, no, no. At the fight. At the fight, I'm taking a picture. I took a picture with Charleston White. Let's take a flick. Why? Charleston White buttered me up, man. Buttered me up. You know, uh, told me that, oh, man, you cool, man. You know? Hey man, I wanna I wanna straighten out all that LA stuff I was talking. You know, that's what he tell me. At this time, I I don't have knowledge of what LA stuff he's really talking about. I'm not, you know, I never really fed into his content. I I don't care, right? I, I he 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 yay how he like yay how you feel me? Like if you like see me in person, like hey, listen. I put him in the headlock quick, grab him. It wasn't that serious for me. Just another person here now documenting, trying to create content around it, right? Everybody else doing it while I can't do it. I have a media pass on. You feel me? I got my team with me. You know, like, we, we moving through there backstage. We all through. So, like... Oh, what's up, Black Man? Come on, nigga Charles Street. Y'all know what's happening, man. Live and direct. My nigga not fighting tonight. Yeah, they just but, qualified, you know man. They can say, I want to apologize to the commission, man. I'm sorry. I thought they were trying to do some more other shit. Uh, I got disqualified for what happened at the venue yesterday. So, shit, it is what it is. Went crazy, man. Went viral. You know what I'm saying? Viral gang in the house. Charles Street, why y'all know what it is, man? It's Mo Free TV. Man, Mo Free TV, man. It's been a lot of love. Peace and love, baby. You know. I had called in to know Joe Will. Flacco called me. So let's get to this. So before all that, Flacco called me and all that. I, my bad getting off subject. Brick had something to say about it about a week, week later on No Jump. You know what I'm saying? He had something to say about it. I brought my nigga Brick in here so we can holler. We can get this clear, man. You understand? Uh, you know, some shit was told to me. About three, four, maybe four days ago, something when uh, Sway came back from Jumper. You know, he had mentioned that, you know, my name got brought up. 
you know, uh, me and Brick got on the phone, you know, because there's been a lot of I'm shit not, going I'm on anyway. So. I can't mention it. So, look, it's been a lot of shit going on anyway, so I've been meaning to holler at Brick. So, me and Brick got on the line today, and we, be, we you know, we chopped it up on Crip. You know, a lot of shit going on, homie. So, you know, we, we just trying to get some shit clear yeah. and get yeah. a full understanding. But, so, it was told to me, though, but you were saying, Sway, that, you know, a nigga had spoke on me taking a picture with Charleston White. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and from boy. what, from from what Brick telling me, Brick telling me that was a private conversation between y'all. That wasn't even on camera. Nah, when uh, we was on camera, remember Brick? You said we had said, uh, you know, Flacco mentioned Flacco was like, yeah, um, whoop 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 about about Rocco, and I was like, yeah, shout out Rockstar. Who put me on the platform? Don't try to start a yawning, nigga. Don't try to use that as a tactic, nigga. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, nigga. Relax. So anyway, so nigga, the nigga said, um, uh, yeah, uh, let me, hey, hey, you put your earphones on to make the loud microphone, don't you? I think so. I don't know. I ain't never I did know. that shit. I ain't never did it either. We ain't no real clubhouse niggas, man. We just, <laughs> but keep Go going. Ahead. Yeah, he just did, all, all Brittany said, he just, he just didn't appreciate how you was being messy. So he said, and then the Flacco got onto the situation on the subject. He was like, oh, uh, yeah, but whoop, 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 whoop. I said that ain't how you said it, Swag. That ain't how you said it, Swag. I said that on camera. I said, about, I said it in Red Pig. We was on your head. We was on your head. And then you deflected, you deflected from you. And you was like, Brick Baby was like, Nah, nigga, I said some shit about Flacco. Hey, I don't think that's short. Nah, nigga, I said sharp? Flacco. Nah, I said sharp Flacco. just said he coming in right now. Yeah, he red pill, don't try to play on me. What it do? I, I, I said that shit about. I said that shit about Flacco, nigga. So look, yeah, Flacco brought it up. I'm look, play on me, nigga. So when I told you about about me, when I went into depth, I didn't bash my boy on camera, none. When I when we talked about uh how I did agree. Or whatever the case was, which which you have all right to, you get what I'm saying. Oh, six, but, so you know I never bash like talk about. I don't feel I did did did, did I come off at any type of way that nigga like I was nigga arguing with. I mean going against my homeboy, or was we talking about nigga? I let whack come in the build, nigga. I let other niggas come in the build, nigga. I can't nigga control how my homeboy run his business, but I don't I don't agree with a nigga. <laughs> Yeah. That's what I said. The nigga said he thought you was being missed. So then, like, all right, man. Like, okay, you got something to say about this? What does that mean? Like, like, I, I took offense to it a little bit. I'm like, why would Brick say that? Why would Brick do that? You know what I'm saying? Like, he, like, he, he don't mean that. Like, he don't mean that. So now I'm looking at it like, damn, he looking at me some type of way? Like, he feel like, well, I'm supposed to do something? Like, what am I supposed to do? Because I was confused about it, like, you know, but a lot of people were like, oh, he talked about Nipsey. You know, Nipsey was your nigga. How could you do that? You were supposed to do this, do that. And I'm thinking to myself, like, bro, bro, like, y'all expect me to jump out the window for y'all, because y'all the one portraying this energy online for him. I don't have to portray that energy. When I see him in per hey, I'm going to grab him up. You know, I ain't got to, you alert with somebody, let them know what you're going to do before you do it. I, I ain't got to do all that. Like, if it was going to go down, it was going to go down. Like I said, some of y'all talk about what y'all going to do and don't never do it. You feel me? So I don't even want to hear not at nothing. So I stood on that like it's whatever, like I feel how you wanna feel. I'm coming up in this media game. Uh, you know, I'm not here to police niggas. I'm not here to police the the politics are not existing in this world. And I'll be trying to tell me and y'all see it from what's going on. So fast forward. So Rick said something about that boom. I think I acknowledged him. Uh we made a video about it. We we talked about it on my floor on Clubhouse. Uh, fast forward now. I went to a room on Clubhouse about a week ago. Flacco's in there. You know, this comes from a conversation me and my homeboy KK had. You know, we chopped up on the phone. I'm like, hey, bro, you seen that? Bro, 
He like, bro, I seen that too, bro. Like, that's worse. Like, come on, bro. Like, he was tripping on the homie for taking a picture with Charleston White. But, you know what I'm saying? You over here flicking up with Woody Wood. You feel me? So, yeah, man, that, that, that. Come on, come on, great, man. We gotta be better, bro. We got to do better, man. You know what I'm saying? So then, so Flacco took that brand with it, ran with the content, boom, he's using it on No Jumper Live. They FaceTime me in the middle of No Jumper Live. Everybody sees what's going on. Uh, you know, I basically told Rick, like, bro, like, and it was a lot of stuff y'all couldn't hear because they wasn't, Rick wasn't holding up the phone to the mic and stuff. I was, I was trying to get my point across, but, you know, the time that y'all did hear me, I'm basically telling them, like, bro, you wouldn't known that. You was on me for doing that, but you wouldn't known that, and I ain't even tripping. I ain't passing no judgment. Do what you do. So don't pass no judgment on me. You know what I'm saying? So that's where I'm at with it. And, uh, you know, that's a clip, like. Break the last three days because like I'm working on the baby drill documentary me and and my god blender we about to talk crazy yeah right so you know so so I'm taking like a three day break right but when I take a break I still watch people you know have been really mad at you right a few people like like YSL Mondo uh, uh, now I don't want to say my guy because he did a clubhouse room you feel me he was saying that he's not even mad but he's saying, yo, yo, when I did something similar, Brick Baby was on his podcast talking about how. Who is it? So Rockstar said that the no. like, so, so. Don't try to start like something no, that's no, doesn't, listen, doesn't Rock, exist because no, Rock. Wait, 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 no, wait, he went out his way to go kick it with Rock. I was there though, okay. right? He asked yeah, Charles no, White for a picture. I just want to make sure. Woody asked I was me in the for room, a picture. Right? Right? Look, no, the rock star didn't say that you did anything wrong, and he's saying, "Bro, we in this podcast space, we should be allowed to kick it with whoever." But nah, but though when I true. was paid to be at this boxing event, and Charleston White was there, and we took a picture, Brick was going off on me. Feel me, right? You feel me? You were but paid, then, well, but, no, but, you but were then, paid to be at the boxing yeah, yeah, event. Yeah, he yeah. putting extras on it. No, <laughs> yeah. Show me the cash check from that boxing event. <laughs> Huh? Show me the check from the boxing Shit, event. Hell, I'm not me... talking about you. I'm talking about my yeah, brother. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. FaceTime me. Yeah, you feel me? I'm about to call Rockstar right you now. You know that's my brother. Yeah, we like all, said, we, but, we but, all, but, we but all. But at the end all. of the day, it's a whole different scenario. I wasn't getting paid. I wasn't yeah. doing nothing. I know I'm from Atlanta by, you know what I'm saying? Proxy. That's my second wait, home. Wait, wait. And I'm not, hold on. And oh, I'm not okay. letting nobody, like, slide around the city. That's like if I was with you or that's true. Yo, Rockstar, listen, right? So, one, we are live right now on a jumper, okay? Now, listen. Yeah. Uh, I told Break Baby that, that you were not mad or upset, and, like, you do feel like us as podcasters should be able to go out, you feel me, and link with whoever, but you felt like he was, was like, hard on you for, 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 for taking a picture with, with, with um, Charleston White. So, yeah. So, uh, so uh, you know, Lush and Brick is here. So, yeah, can you just, you know... A Expound on your particular, I guess, narrative or no, that's 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 all it was. You know, Brick, my brother, you know, yeah. that's true. Brick, he 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 uh, he you know, he he you know, he texted you. Nah, I've been going, I ain't been pick, I ain't been picking up for nobody. No, everybody know that shit. It ain't even, it ain't even be. It, it's some shit going on at the house that I gotta make sure it's straight. Put the top of his photo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's so, both yeah. speakers. It was okay, nothing. Gotcha. We, you know, me and the homie talk. We was like, man, hold on. Nah, nah, I'm not even. I, I wasn't even almost, almost this. I was about to say I wasn't even tree IEs happy. But uh, <laughs> uh, 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 what I'm about to say, nah, I ain't even tripping off that, bro. Right? But a motherfucker, what I was saying was, it's, it is two different. Situations. Situation. I slide to the hood down there. I'm from Atlanta. I got my white boy with me. He wants to slag around the streets of Zone 3. Nigga, I'm not finna lead that nigga over there, nigga, and then come back and they talk about, oh, a nigga done pulled up and did some troll shit to Adam and hopped out, tried to slap him. And, you get what I'm saying? So I'm right there. No part no part of the vlog where you see Brick Baby Face. I wasn't in there. We went bowling together. No part of the interview where you see Brick, Brick Baby Face. I was taking a motherfucking picture against the brick wall at Main Street because they be putting all the celebrities that come, they put all the celebrities that come up there on the wall. While we doing that, 
I've been knowing Woody since he was about 16, 17 years old. I used to stay across the street. Me and TM used to stay across the street from his grandma. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Shout to so now I know I'm right here with him. If I ain't going to start no drama, bro, like, let's get one. Okay, I took a picture. You get what I'm saying? Look, I understand your relationship with Cuz and all that. But look, I got no relationship to Charleston. Well, I don't know Cuz from not a name, not a Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I got paid to be at that event. I, I told you. Paid. Understandable. <laughs> but when we when we talked, I wasn't tripping. I just, yeah, yeah. But you did bring it up on no joke. Yeah, hell yeah, I'm going to bring it up. Because <laughs> so right, look, you not beefing with Woody. I am. That's like you, you might as well have whack and trust and white one picture like, yeah, my homie Brick Baby, nigga. That's why I spoke on it. Cause I beef with the nigga. And nigga Charleston White, I don't give a damn. We don't got no real paper. <laughs> We can do that. We media. Oh, West Side, though. At the time, cause you wasn't, you wasn't on that. You feel yeah, me? that's the thing. Nah. It was a different era. That's yeah, that's what I'm saying. Nah, but but the more that I was talking about, and it's some rat shit. But like Charles White podcast, ain't known for, for 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 ratting. He known for trolling the homies and shit. And, and that's also, why I was like, cause also, went down there, and, just like when you and White got back cool. I'm like, cause look at you, cause don't call me with nigga. You know how we talk, nigga. When we be talking, I'm like, cause don't call me with cause go left. I ain't happened in the rooms with you. Know about, nigga. Rock, yeah. when, 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 and when was that, Rock? When when, when did that uh, picture with you and Charleston happen? Last year. Last year. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was at a boxing event. And you, you Rock, playing? you know damn well. Hold on, let him. What did you say? Yeah, it was at a boxing event. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know he was in there. You know niggas was making. Like I said, there was other niggas in there that had that energy online. And seen Cuz and really never used to. Oh, see, I'm running from Cuz when I see him, so I ain't just be out there better than me. Issues leading up to that with Cuz, like, I never really acknowledged Cuz like that, you feel me? So. And he's charming like in person, me. right? You said what? And bro, listen, yo, he's charming as fucking prick. Listen, yeah. bro, he's if you nice be charged to white, it's impossible to like the nigga. <laughs> right? Like, right? Like, nah, bro, he, 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 I like him. I, I, I hated I like him at him first, too. and now I be watching bro, it like, man. he should have came out like this. If he would have came out on what he was on, I don't think we would have uh, we would have beefed. But the whole shit is, he be talking about nip and shit. So when a nigga talk about nip online, it's like, fuck her. Understandable. To me, I feel like you grown as a person, as a podcaster in this, you understand the game a little exactly. more than exactly. you did when you first came. Yeah, in. I came from yelling at my phone on Instagram. That's how yeah. I started, nigga. I ain't know nothing about you no know. YouTube. Right. Fuck. So now, you know, he justified, he's trying to justify to me that because he knows Woody and he lived across the street from Woody and all this and this and that. You know, it, it's a different relationship. Bro, I don't know Charleston White from nothing. Y'all heard it in the clip. I don't, from nothing. I'm there in the media getting paid. He didn't believe I got paid. Shout out to Lemon Lemon, because I definitely got paid. And go ask him for the receipts if you want the receipts. It was cash app, cash. You feel me? And they plugged my whole people, everybody that I brought. Got into free passes, all that. We, you know, we was chilling. We was in the building. Trust me, I was part of that marketing budget. I was definitely in there. You know what I'm saying? So it's like put some little bit more respect on my name. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to this, like, you know, because I didn't got my issue out of this and I'm still grinding. I'm still grinding. You know what I'm saying? It's still a grind. So, uh, yeah, I, you know, and it's crazy because I didn't hear all that stuff before. You know what I'm saying? Like before uh, uh, I called in, I wasn't even watching no jumper. Or before Flacco called me, my bad. I wasn't even watching no jumper. So I didn't hear all the stuff leading up to it. Talking about showing me the receipts, showing him, like he ain't believe I got paid to be there. But I ain't got a cap. Ain't no cap in this rap. You feel me? At all. Trust. So, okay. Now, leading up to this, you're, you're justifying why you're taking pictures with Woody. You didn't even have to interact, engage. You knew you was going to catch this heat. Thug supposed to be your man. Thug supposed to be your man. But you still kicking him with Woody. Me, I'm on some business. I ain't doing all that. We, every day, I didn't, you know, it was a media picture. I had a media pass on. Like, they see what I'm here for. I'm trying to build this brand. You confusing the people. Brave is not making sense to us. You know, woman, and even on the clip, you tell me, 
you beefing with Woody. How you beefing with Woody and y'all send me a cool? Yeah, this ain't no real beef. Y'all lived across the street from each other, grandma, whatever, all this. And it's like, bro, don't. To me, it's like, bro, you never know until the shoe is on the other foot, right? You never know. So, you know, in that situation with me and him, you feel me? So, and then Wayne had made some points to that too, was saying, like, you know, he was on him about the 6 9 but he was on him, and now Brick came up with Woody. Brick has accepted he's a podcaster, from my understanding. From what I keep seeing in clips, and him sitting there with Adam, he like, I don't care no more. Like, it is what it is. Y'all don't think of me what y'all think of me. Cool. But I feel like you should have had better understanding coming into it. You know what I'm saying? Because coming into it, you didn't have that same understanding. And that's what I swear in that clip. Also, when I was on the phone, like, you, you grown as a podcaster because now you see what this, what it is and, and what, you know, and not to take it so personal, not to be so invested in it, right? You know, when you're a content creator, you, you can't get so caught up in the hype. You got to let the people do that, and you got to still be, you know, uh, isolated somewhat and, 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 and somewhat stick to your roots and your gut, what you know. You know, don't fall for it. You know what I'm saying? So this is my thing. Uh, great. You know, homie, you already know we get down, you know what I'm saying, West Rubber. And we're going to tell it like it is. <clears throat> you know, I, to me, I just feel like let's not pass judgment to nobody. You know what I'm saying? Especially your own homie. Get on the phone with the nigga when you can really holler. And, you know, we got mutual individuals here. Woo -woo, here woo -woo, woo to text me, call me. We're going to make it happen. We're going to get on the line. That's why I said on there, too. Like, you know, um, like, yeah. Y'all got to know, like, internet from real life, real life from internet, and where we stand. My homies, my my, my circle, my kids know where I stand in real life. So, this internet, how y'all think it, I'm portrayed or people are portrayed, they might be portrayed to y'all like that, but in the real life, on the in the field, trust me, it's not the same. It's not the same, so some of y'all get it twisted, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, I say that to say, you know, Brick has done this thing also in these streets, right? So have I. But we have grown now. We are, we are on to bigger and better things, man. Y'all got to stop holding us to the old us. Like, I understand we uh, uh, uh coming into this because of who we used to be, obviously. You know what I'm saying? So that's the attraction. That's what got us here on all summer. Now we're like, you know, it's it's an elevation game, man. And, and, and to elevate, you got to separate. You feel me? And, that, and that's point blank. Hey, man, I appreciate y'all rocking with me on Rockstar Rants. Y'all stay tuned for more. If y'all like this, man, hop in these comments right now. Let me know what you think, man. I'm just speaking my truth, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and giving an honest, raw, authentic opinion. You know what I'm saying? No filter. You know, right here, I'm going to chop it up with y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be dropping these. So y'all stay tuned for more. Y'all already know. Rocks for my rants. Stay tuned for more. Like, comment, subscribe right now. Become a member. Turn on your notifications. Hit that bell. Hit that bell, y'all. Y'all know what it is, man. It's your host, Rockstar 2800, the most hated, the most underrated, the most opinionated. You know the truth. Stay tuned.